What's up guys, Hatchback here again, and today we're going to be installing my Spoolin Short Shifter. Let's get to it. Okay, so unfortunately today it's very windy and there's a plane flying with a banner overhead and he's just literally just circling the same mile. So hopefully audio turns out okay this episode. If not, sorry. So anyway, I have to remove some things to get to the short shifter <laughs> mechanism. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to take all this out and possibly this whole battery and housing as well. Let's see and let's get to it. factory shifter that is the shifter cables and these are the bushings that I'm gonna change right here also this is the uh, side to side one to change I'm gonna probably get this out of the way just to make it easier and in fact I probably have to to get to this bolt Okay, quick update. I got the new bushings in for both of these, so that's cool. Uh, I also ended up removing the entire battery battery box just to get a little more room in here because this thing is a pain in the ass to get off. I don't think it's gonna be. This was easy enough. Once you get the clip out, boom, that's fine. This is out and I'm gonna be changing it to this soon enough. But I want to get this bastard out of here first. All right, so another quick update guys. My hands are filthy. So is this towel I'm using to uh, you know, wipe my face and hands. <laughs> um, but progress has been made. It's gone. Took it out. Bye. Check it out, guys. Here's the old shifter. Here's the new one. So the immediate difference is this is fixed, but this is variable, and all the way down here is 40% decrease in shift length, and over here is just factory. So I'm going to be putting it all the way over here. i got to get the actual piece to screw in here. All right, guys. Um... I have the new short shifter in. Got it greased up with the um, side to side part as well. You can tell here. I put it all the way 40% reduction. Got this in nice and greased up. You know, it's uh, looking good. Now I just gotta put these back in, the uh, shifter bushings. And uh, yeah, oh, I also gotta put the piece in here too as well to fit for that. But it's officially in. Everything went smoothly except for getting the original shifter off. That was a pain in the ass. So anyways, time to put back the intake and the battery. There you have it guys, she's put back together. Short shifter down there. Oh yeah. Now let's test her out. 
Okay, moment of truth. Hopefully I put everything back together and my car doesn't explode. But I also need some air conditioning. So. Alright. Starts up. That's good. Alright. Let's see. So the side to side's not that much. I didn't tweak that very much. I pretty much left it the same, maybe a little bit more. But the front to back is... Oh, wow. Yeah, that's a lot. Let's see if... Uh, I find it difficult to... Yeah. Yeah, I literally don't have a reverse gear. That's interesting. Troubling. I'll get back to you.